What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another rewards video. Today we are on the account of Pony Boy one more time. We opened his packs over the weekend. We thought we hit that UCL Griezmann um, and it was UCL uh, Benzema. Remember that? We got trolled. We got trolled hard. We're back on his account today, guys. He has got some Division 1, Rank 1, Untradeable rewards and some Fut Champions Elite 1, I believe. Maybe Elite 2, but I think Elite 1 rewards as well. So before we get into this, guys, if you could drop a thumbs up on the video for this Thursday's video, let's try and smash 5,000 likes. That would be amazing. Of course, Black Friday coming tomorrow. Lots to do. Uh, Ponyboy has 3.6 million coins. And has achieved his uh, results this week with this team. Just again goes to show, I guess he's liquidated for Black Friday, right? But it just again kind of goes to show that skill does prevail. You know, like the team might help you in one, two, maybe three games per weekend. But ultimately, understanding the game mechanics and how they work is primary, uh, you know, primary concern. So he's achieved what he's achieved. With the team that we see on the screen. Interesting that he's actually gone for uh, Fellaini over Fabinho. But I, th I think that's largely due to the specific uh, stats that Fellaini has with that pace and dribbling. Um, but with his squad, he's got David Hare with 26 games. Carvajal with 25. Varane with 22. Bailly with 27. Mendy with 26. Casemiro 22. Fellaini 22. Condogbia 22. Gareth Bale with 486 games, untradeable first own, 419 goals, 261 assists, an absolutely mental return there. Ben Yedder, 35, 39, and 14. Anthony Martial, 22, 14, and 8. He actually opted into buying him. Interesting that he went for him. Uh, Lukaku on the bench trade. He's actually bought a few players here. This is quite weird. He's bought, like, Ben Yedder, uh, Ben Yedder, Martial, both bought, you know, Eric Bailly, paid for Lukaku on the bench paid for this is this is a weird setup I'd love to talk to him and understand why he's got these beasts on the bench um, and then some of these guys in the team and paying for them but guys what we want first of all is his foot rivals division one rank one rewards two ultimate packs and two mega packs as the untradeable rewards of course there is no promo team in packs right now so the best we can hope for outside of the uh you know obviously the regular walkouts and team of the week is we can hope for an icon here today the team of the week obviously does have some absolute machines in it uh, does he have a team uh, uh, inform pack he does he has an inform pack saved up as well so we get two mega packs to start with guys both untradeable uh van dyke harry kane mares they're the kind of players that we're looking for first and foremost especially mares with that uh plus 10 physical we start off with dimitri payet Always nice to get the 84s, you know. Always nice to be able to pick up one of those cards that, especially over Black Friday, and especially if EA release a um, Team of the Week guaranteed uh, like pack, you know, SBC, um, players like that are always going to be nice. So Budaboos, we will send up to the trade pile. No, we won't because he is the first duplicate of uh, of the day. And we'll open Mega Pack number two. Uh, we'll save the premium team of the week pack for the Fight Rivals rewards. We get a walkout. Come on, be an inform or an icon, obviously. It's not. It's just a regular gold inform, Italian, centre mid. It is going to be Verratti once again. All right for SBCs, not the most valuable card, and uh, of course, indeed, not the most um, usable card. You know, he's he, no, I don't ever see him in anyone's, uh, you know, squads in top 100. Uh, so 20,000 coins roughly for the value of Verratti there. But we get our first walkout. We've now got two ultimate packs, and I tell you what. I would be hard pressed to say that we don't get at least one walkout in an ultimate pack. You know, I, I would expect at the very least one walkout. Potentially, what you know, one walkout per pack. Sometimes I, I, I would say, I don't know. I would say personally for me from an ultimate pack. Sorry, I got an eyelash right in my eye. Um, I would say personally for me from an ultimate pack, I would expect. A walkout every pack without fail. What do we get out of this one? No walkout in the first one. We could still get an inform. It is a board at the very least. Uh, let's see what this board is. It is going to be Mario Mandzukic. Another 84. The 84s aren't bad, but this is... I, 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 we've talked about it to death, and, and it looks like... A couple of 83s in there as well. It looks like the EA once again aren't going to be changing the reward structure. But for me... 
the you know the the the, the way the rewards are generated in Fuck Rivals is embarrassing. That this is Division One rank one. You know how highly skilled you have to be to get to this rank, and you get two untradeable ultimate packs where if you get unlucky in them. You might as well have just played a draft, you know, instead of grinding your way up to Division 1 and grinding your way into all of those, uh, into all of those rewards, you might as well have just gone and done a draft. So, ultimate pack number two. Here we go. Give us a board for this one, a walkout for this one. No. So, a mega pack so far gives us our only walkout. It is a board, not a single special card just yet. It's going to be... Uh, it's going to be Zule there. Again, another 84, which isn't bad. I know people mean me on the whole. It isn't bad uh, malarkey. Um, but, you know, it genuinely isn't bad. Uh, that, that, as a 125k pack, is very bad, however. That is absolutely shocking, if I'm being perfectly honest with you. Uh, six duplicates here to go through. But, yeah, some of, some of the worst players. We've got 184. I think an 83 was in there. And then generally after that, it's uh, pretty goddamn useless. All I can hope is that these players come in handy for uh, for Pony Boy during the Black Friday promo and Cyber, Pro F Cyber Monday promo. Uh, I hope it's just good for him. So we will open the Premium Team of the Week pack, guys. Here we go. Can we get a walkout from this? Yes, we can. That is a great start because of how this Team of the Week is. Who's it going to be? Come on, give me the Dutch flag. Scott, oh, God, it's uh, Forrest, is it? The right mid. Um, yeah, so it is a walkout in form, though. That's not so bad. I don't think he's worth crazy amounts. I think he's about 30k. Um, Rasha and Collins in there as well. Oh, wow, he's plummeted a little bit today. Fair play. Uh, he is under 20k player. Uh, so that's pretty tough. But, dudes, that was obviously the Div 1, Rank 1 rewards. We now have Fuck Champions rewards. So, once again, congratulations to Ponyboy for finishing in Elite 2. Uh, he did indeed get uh, tw 26 wins, I believe. Um, so, three player pick packs, one premium team of the week pack, one 100k pack. And can we get lucky? In these three-player pick packs. Number one. Come on, EA. Sh show us something amazing here. As, I mean, this Bat Shawi card, it's not bad. Five-star weak foot, four-star skill moves, medium low, which is the same as Aubameyang, 6-1. Great shooting, good dribbling, 68 stamina for an 84-rated Michi Bat Shawi. That's pretty poor. Um, Rusnak, no one cares about. Olsen, no one cares about. Yedva Yedvaj. No one cares about ZH. This card is all right. Good stam, good dribbling, good passing. All right shooting, all right pace. Uh, uh, Pony Boy says he wants bat, shall we? So there is pick number one. I would love to see Sane, Marez, Kane, Valencia, Vinaldum, Pjanic, Salah, Van Dijk, or Alisson. Show me one of those, or two of those, or three of those guys. It's bat, shall we? Again, what is this? What is this? We're going to get Forrest. Or ban Watson or Olsen. I can only assume that Forrest is going to be the go-to guy. Good pace. Good. I mean, he's got good pace. You've got to give him that. He has got good pace. Let's see if we can get a... Uh, another. I, I think he's going to want to go with Forrest. Yeah, so he says Forrest. He also LMAOs because he knows that he is getting shafted right now. And then last but not least, pick number three. Give us a big pull. Valencia is Good. Vinaldum is all right. Vinaldum is all right. Not amazing. I think Antonio Valencia is going to have to be the one. Um, could still use him at right back, you know, uh, with like starting with a three back formation and using the game plans to to send him in there. It's not a bad pick, but what I mean, this is this is terrible. Um, he says, "Damn, that's tough." I'll take Valencia because I'm a United fan, and that guys, this is for 26 wins. I mean, 384s, I've seen worse. I have seen worse, but we didn't see Alisson, Van Dijk, Salah, Pjanic, Kane, Mares, or Sané at all. So that, guys, is pretty damn tough. Hopefully, this 100k pack and Team of the Week pack to end off this video, whoops, can be much, much better for us and give us a little bit of hope that, being good at this game is rewarding. So the 100k pack gives us absolutely no uh, walkout again, no special card again. It's going to be Florent Tovan. 
Uh, I said that right. You ask any Frenchman, I said that right. So we get an 84 rated there in Tovan. <sighs> it's not ideal, is it, guys? It's not ideal. Um, we've, we have seen better. Two 84s in there, though, which isn't the worst thing in the world. And again, I know people meme me when I say that. But um, it really isn't the worst thing in the world. Now, from this final Team of the Week pack, guys, I need to see a big big pull to end things off here come on EA show us the walkout animation it's not even a walkout it is an 83 or lower and there are, I don't even think there's any 83s this is going to be one of the worst packs you'll ever see oh my god it is it is one of the worst packs you're ever going to see we get a Ruznak as our main card so for a man that finished uh 26 and 4 he is I mean Je Jedav He's not even worth anything. For a Bundesliga as well, guys, he's worth like under 20k. That 15k, that's mental. That's mental. Um, Pony Boy says, I'm on the blacklist instead of the red list. I can't even I can't even disagree. That is some tough, tough luck, guys. This is gonna be the end of the video for today. If you did enjoy this, be sure to leave a like, rating, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. But for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.